What's up guys, welcome to Lance Lundy Boxing. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to check out my other videos, they're all boxing related. If you like this video, don't forget to drop a like. And if you're new to the channel, maybe subscribe and click that bell notification if you like the content on this channel. So today I'm gonna to give you guys my prediction between Gervonta Tank Davis and Hector Luis Garcia. So Tank is 27 and 0 with 25 KOs. He's 28 years old, he stands at five foot five with a 67 inch reach. Hector Luis Garcia is 16 and 0, 10 KOs. He's 31 years old. He stands at 5 foot 9, and he has a 67 inch reach. Now to start off, this fight's going to be for the WBA World Lightweight Championship. This will be the first fight for Garcia at 135 pounds. He started off his career at 126, and he's competed at 130 pounds. Tank has also fought at 126 pounds. He moved all the way up to 140, though. Tank seems to be like the naturally bigger fighter between these two, but we'll see come fight night. Another thing to mention is that these two fighters are southpaws. Everyone finds a southpaw weird, even southpaws find southpaws weird. So my prediction for this fight is that Gervonta Davis is going to win. I see him knocking out Garcia within six rounds. I'm not a betting man, but if I were to bet, I'd put my money on Tank by KO within six rounds. I think that Tank is the bigger fighter, the stronger fighter, the faster fighter. With He has better IQ, better ring generalship. I don't think that Garcia stands a chance against Tank, unfortunately, in this fight. This fight is a tune-up fight for Tank. I believe it's going to be an easy win for him on January 7. Another thing to mention is that Garcia is an Olympian. He did the Olympics in 2016. However, I can't see him beating Tank. Another thing to mention is that he is currently the WBA Super World Champ at 130 pounds. So even though he loses this fight, there's no repercussions for him because he still keeps his 130 pound belt since he's fighting at 135 pounds in this fight. So even though he loses in this fight, it gives him great exposure, probably a good money fight for him. But like I said, guys, this is a tune-up fight for Tank. It'll be an easy win for him. I see a KO within six rounds. You guys can put your money on it, but I'm not a betting man, guys. And this is not betting advice. So anyways, that's my prediction for this fight, guys. Very short video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share this video. Let me know who you think is going to win in the comment section below. See you guys in the next one. Peace.